again thanks for watching today i'm going to briefly talk about a collection that's going to be releasing um in just a few days this is the target lego collection and i personally think that it's really really a cool collection um i know that some people are going to be ready to click off of this immediately like lego what um <laughs> but this collection is it's nice guys just trust me it's nice um so they had a pop-up um at different locations there was one um near my house so i did go there um this was probably about a week or two ago um, I took my daughter and they had some of the pieces from the collections there. They had like activities and things of that nature, photo ops. Um, and they had like um, a mobile checkout set up. Um, and the way that it worked is that you got to kind of go around, walk around and explore. Um, they had some small little activities for kids. Um, and you could scan whatever items that they had the items displayed in this uh, certain way with little barcodes. And you could scan whatever items that you wanted. Or that you were interested in while you were looking and choose the color and all those things and add it to your bag and at the end um you go to checkout and you go to the checkout stand and um they help you check out what the items that's in your bag um and from there they go and pull those items and they bring them to the checkout call your number and you um get your you're able to receive your items that way um i tried to so I did try to record some video, um, like some footage or whatever, but my daughter was really just not having it. She was crazy excited. Um, so I wasn't able to do that. Um, so I, I didn't get to style this kind of like a vlog like I originally wanted to. Um, I was barely able to like briefly scan the event with my camera. Um, but that I have to do for now. What I'll do is I'll just show you guys. Okay, so I'm gonna quit talking and just share the things that I got. So the first item I got was this. This is a, um, like a storage case. I'm gonna use it like a little mini bag or purse or whatever. This came in multiple colors and I just thought that this was super cute. This was affordable. I can't remember if it was like $8 or $12, but it was somewhere along that range. And yeah, I just think that's super cool. The next item I got was this plush and it is in the color pink, but there were multiple other colors. I know for sure red um there was blue i can't remember the other colors that they had um they also had a plush that was like a uh, lego santa claus and there was also a gingerbread um plush as well which my daughter wanted um this came in a whole bunch of different colors it was like 14 dollars or something like that i will go back in and put the prices or any corrections um for the sake of me the next item that i have is this pair of pants this is sweatpants. These were part of the men's collection. These are in a size small. And they have a sweat jacket as well, which I do intend on buying. Um, these were $30. And they have a top that goes with it, but they did not have um, the tops available at the pop-up shop so i do have to get the top on the fourth with the rest of the collection um let me see if the other items have oh yeah they have prices on them so this was 14.99 and this one was 12 dollars hope y'all can see that 12 dollars the oh it's the flying out the next item that I had was these cookie cutters and these were three dollars and I just thought that these were cool to make my daughter um like lego shaped cookies um the next item that I got was this little keychain and it's like a mini little lego elf and this was I don't remember the price, but I want to say it was like five dollars or something like that. Okay, the next thing that oh, this is stuff that they just put like inside of here. 
So this is like, um, they gave out these little cups of Legos to kids and they can build stuff. It tells you how to build something. And then the, this was like a little mask that they gave out there. Um, and I guess they put them in all the bags. And so this was also cool, but I'm going to give this to my daughter because I think she broke the one that she got there. And the last item that I got from this collection was this. And this is, um, these are storage heads. Um, how much? I'm looking for the price. Okay. This was $25 and it's a set of two. So there's this one and there's another one inside. And what I intend on using this for is to store my, um, to store my nail polish. I'm going to take this out the box. And this is what we have. And this is the size of it. And I also bought another set of these. Um, I'm not showing my daughter's stuff right here. Most of her stuff is for Christmas, but she did get to keep two of her items. Um, but I don't, I don't have her stuff here to show you guys. Um, this is the second one. This is a smaller one. And originally, I was going to give this one to my daughter. But my, um, we ended up getting her her own. So with this one, I'm probably going to store beauty blenders inside of it. And they like nest inside of each other like this. And so here we have it. You guys check out the collection. See if there's anything that you want. Let me know if there's something that you intend on grabbing. Um, this collection, like I said, definitely has something for everybody. Um, there's like stuff for kids, stuff for adults. There's like home stuff anything like all types of things um so there's definitely something for everybody um okay so for the next three minutes or so of this video um i'm just on target's website previewing the entire collection um if you don't want to see this skip ahead or watch some of it or whatever it is that makes you happy um I know that I'll be picking up some more pieces of this collection tomorrow. A lot of it is expected to sell out pretty quickly. So you are able to preview the entire collection and you can just um, save any of the items that you like and that you want to get for sure tomorrow with the little heart. Um, and so when it's when the collection goes live, you can quickly um, find those items and add them to your cart. Um, I know that I'll be doing that. I'm going to go back on and add the few pieces that I still want to get um so yeah let me know if you guys check this out if you want anything from this collection um don't click off this video yet um because i am going to talk about one other really really cool collection um in just a few minutes So the blankets and the throw pillows in this collection are really, really nice. The pictures don't really do them justice. They did have them at the event and in person. They are so nice and the quality is so great. Um, so that's definitely something to check out if you're into that type of thing.
So here you can see the plushes that I was talking about and other colors that are available. Also the gingerbread and the Santa Claus. So the next collection I'm going to talk about is Mattel's Collaboratory Collection. Um, so what they did is they worked with four different artists um, to recreate some popular toys or whatever to create limited editions of these toys. Um, so I just previewed the items that are available, the four artists. As of now, three of the items can still be ordered for, they can still be ordered on pre-order. But one of them, um, this Hot Wheel by Evan Mock, has sold out completely, so you cannot get that one any longer. But you can order the other three options um, on pre-order as of now today. Um, I'm not quite sure how long they'll be available for, but as of now, they are available with a limit of two for each person to order. Um, I personally have already ordered this morning. Um, I ordered the Alele May. Um, Barbie wardrobe and I also ordered the blue the gray Thomas the trains I ordered two one for me and one for my daughter um, I just think that this collection is super super cool and if you're into this type of thing then definitely check it out um, yeah so thank you guys for watching bye